Shut up, Greg! <laughs> Greg! <laughs> He's just trying to get his job back. Hey! Up. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm Nikki, and we are the Norries, and we're ready. We're we're okay. Yeah, that was so bad. We're here to watch this session, season one, episode one. Stop looking at me, Christopher. I don't know the name of it. Celebration. Um, celebration. All right, just forewarning, guys. I have seen this show, seen the first season. I love it. I love it so much. This is like my type of show, so I'm super excited for these guys. If it was too. super good, why did you stop watching it after the first season? Um, because I just haven't had time, Christopher. <laughs> I don't like. The this rest show. of us are going in blind, blind. as a bat. Uh, Mickey did show me the pilot years ago because he was hell bent on showing it to me. I don't quite remember much of it. it was he the one who sh like was this a song he was hell bent about the intro like this is the best yeah, intro yeah, 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 the best intro I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> Certain kind of people like Succession. You know what I mean? Y'all know the kind of people I'm talking about. No, I think I heard it's a really good show. I mean, it ended this past year, so we're a little bit late to the train here. But uh, we are gonna have a Mickey and a Pat joining us momentarily. Oh, if you didn't know, by the way, my name is Suraj. Hey, it's Run on Happy November first. My name is Chris motherfucking Johnson. And I'm Nikki. That's right, November 1st is when we filmed this, and these have been on Patreon for a while. Yeah. So Patreon has exclusive shows sometimes, Succession being one of them, Beef and Peacemaker, Peacemaker being some yeah. other ones. Yeah, all, the, all, the, all, the, all those shows that I was on in the like, past three months are just Patreon. So I'm like, you're a Patreon you're exclusive. exclusive. You're special. No. You're just Patreon you're exclusive, exclusive Normie. Normie. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what? Welcome to the Nikki couch. Yeah, all right, bet. You know, all right, cool. All right, I'm here for this. Yeah. I usually bully Runner, and the most she does is cry about it, and then Nikki fucking bit me. So, as of now, I have no idea what's going to happen, but I do know this. Not a market substitute. Support the OG content. Feel free to support the normies over on Patreon. Support the normies on Patreon means you can watch ahead, you can watch uncuts, and. Participate in polls! Participate in polls. Uh, uh, uh. Not on your mama's poll in her bedroom. No, on hey. your mommy's Patreon poll. Your mom has to pay for college somehow, and I appreciate that. I wish my mom would have. I have so much debt. <laughs> Maybe Succession will teach me. <laughs> Please yeah. like and subscribe. We are nothing without you guys. Aww. It's so dark. Who is it? <laughs> Fucking some old person. You can hear him grunting like old folks do. Me. <laughs> Where the fuck am I? Dude, is he drugged or something? Are you drunk? It sounds like he might be old and have dementia, and he's peeing on the floor. Oh. Yeah, that's pee on floor sound. That sucks. No. Oh no. The pee's way too yellow. No. Like Oof. my dog. Why am I? We're in the new place. Oh, I love her. She's in Rami. She's Rami's mom. She's Arab. Arab! Jesus Christ! Out <laughs> stones, water towers, trees, skyscrapers, fight fighters, and Wall Street traders. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah. Us. laughs> The day we make it happen, Fikret. Fikret. You're the man, Mr. Roy. You're the man. This is what you gotta say to rich people. Yeah. Just pump their egos up. <laughs> Oh yeah, thank you. He's on a dollar chair tip. Yeah, you're so fucking cool, boss. Your dick is huge, man. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I fucking hate people. I mean, it's New York. It's not a fucking excuse. Absolutely not. <laughs> what? New Yorkers would finish their cigarette with pride. Nope, that's wrong. Totally would not. <laughs> that is literally what New Yorkers would do. Cover it on the ground. All right, the, the intro is, is really good. I don't know if the song is really nice. Karen Culkin. Macaulay Culkin's brother. The one from Scott Pilgrim, right? Yep. Oh, shit. This makes me want to become a fucking conglomerate. Let's, Let's go to the go. Hamptons, guys. You want to become a conglomerate? <laughs> just, just the entity of a conglomerate. I just want to I, surge ascend to personhood. My brand, I need to become a brand. <laughs> Bro, I just want to go to the Hamptons now watching this. That's it. Let's, uh, let's just go You guys need to watch fucking KGF. Please, let's watch that movie. Oh, is that an indie movie? Yes. I've never heard this part in the intro. I only ever heard the... this. Right here. Hey, hey, hey. I love that. Hey, 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 buddy. So, we ready to fuck or what? What? <laughs> yeah, well, okay. This is how rich people talk. <laughs> Look, I, I'm really sorry, but it, it looks like there's an issue. Well, I came all the way up the here, zoom dude. in. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, dude. You know I love what you do. I think Volter is the shiz. What? Are you talking <laughs> like shiz? 
Yeah. It's, it's like mockumentary style yeah. zooms, kind of. Yeah, is the camera like falling? Jaguar? I just think bottom line, I can deliver a lot more value for our shareholders. They're trying to do a buyout? Come on, that's it? It's annoying to meet in person just to say that. Yeah, this could have been an email. A yeah. power move. Yeah. I'm not letting you Neanderthals in to rape my company. Oh, Sorry. shit. A bunch of bloated dinosaurs who didn't even notice some monkeys swinging by until yesterday. Well, fuck you, daddy's boy. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Come on, don't blow this Loaded up. Loaded dinosaurs, my new favorite thing. I got a track record for founding one of the most exciting new media brands in the world. What do you got? Track marks from shooting junk? <gasps> Thanks for coming down. It's great to meet you. Damn drama. Nikki, I see why you like this show. Off the bat. <laughs> what the fuck, Frank? I... Frank! Do you want to call your dad? Do I want to call my dad? No, I don't want to call my dad. Do you want to call your dad? <laughs> Just raw dog in that phone. Yeah, huh? I'm uh, right in the middle, Dad. Hey, that's what I do, baby. Yeah, it's okay. We're not quite close. <clears throat> well, what are you gonna do to buy this company that hates you? That guy vehemently does not want to do business with you. Damn, he has a one. A you miss yours, is what you were a gonna good say. Good old days. <laughs> you miss your one. <laughs> I when I was actually young. Mickey had one exactly like that when uh you know back in the day back in the day, back in the day you know we're old yeah. and responsible we're now exactly Nikki's the only one that smokes marijuana here. no one oh believes my any of that. fucking god you're joining one of the most no. dynamic news what is this green screen companies in the world news and entertainment okay how's everyone feeling so awesome well let's go out and give these kids the best day of their lives huh did we just watch a commercial. About news, so this guy can go be a fucking dinky dog. What is this? <laughs> oh, that was weird. <laughs> so, are there any background we need to know about this, Nikki? Because I remember Mickey telling me this is like loosely based on the, uh, the, the 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 family that owns Fox. Yeah. Or something, right? Yeah, yeah. Loosely, it's not like direct correlation. Like, yeah, yeah. It. This is like loosely based it's on. It's kind of based on like how fucked up news is. Gotcha. Yeah. Like the business side of it, yeah. and like the people that yeah. own it. Yeah. Dude, that's so much vomit. This way, this way, this way. Come on. Yeah. I totally forgot about that. Song. Oh, hell Fucking no. disgusting. I sort of screwed up. They were just like, get all your stuff and go. Did you even think for one second to tell them who you are? You're gonna go to the party and you're gonna look nice. Grown up shirt and a grown up blazer. A blazer? <laughs> a blazer? It's just asking questions. I everything. hate them all already. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> Hey, 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 motherfuckers. <laughs> motherfuckers. You okay, man? Man, I'm I'm so over it. I was a bad fit. You know, I was never a corporate you? cocksuck anyway. Stuck me in LA with old Father Time right here. We were the pool boys, right, Frank? Good times. Hmm? Frank is cool. <laughs> I love Frank. So, what's the bid? Frank looks like he's over this shit. <laughs> he's, been, like he's been over this shit. He's just in it for the money. It seems like they're all just in it for the money. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thanks for coming back. He's just chaos. He just came with some chaos and love. Look at all this fucking bullshit. Mm, yes, mm, very serious. <laughs> 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 mm, yes. Mm. He's actually making fun of him. He's like, do you all really need to be here in suits and shit for the things that you do? Which is basically just like, let's buy this. Let's let's bid on that. If they don't look serious, people won't take them serious. And that's true. I love that this is his wife. I'm so excited. Is she just in it for the money? She got he got that young wife. He already on death's door over here, so doesn't matter. She gonna get the money. The air with the they are. As ordered. I don't want a fucking heart attack from the surprise, and I don't want anyone in my face when I come out of the elevator. Do you want me to email you the exact details of the surprise? Mm -mm. When I said that his wife was young, I was wrong. <laughs> yeah, I thought she was. I thought she looked a lot younger from a distance today. She's she's not as old as he is, but yeah. she's like she's older. She seems nice. Look, we don't know the character yet. I know, like the, the actress. Character. I love the actress. I'm obsessed with her. Fuck the actress. No. The actress is at an asshole. No. I'm just kidding. You know, to strategize my gift. What can I get him to love? It needs to say that I, I respect you, but I'm not awed by you. I like you, but I need you to like me before I can love you. A watch. Look, everything that you get him will mean an equal amount of nothing. <laughs> so make sure it looks like 10 to 15 grand's worth and you're good. You fucking high? 10, 15 grand for an old man is not going to so, appreciate it. So this is what it's like. A really sexy package look like. What did he put on a burrito? Ketchup? What did he put on a burrito? I hope he's throwing a blowjob too. I'll throw in a blowjob. I'll throw in a blowjob. McDonald's sauce. Is he eating McDonald's? Throwing a reach around. Hell, I'll even uh, cup his balls. <gasps> his dad's right there. 
Yeah. I thought you'd be in St. Bart's by now. <laughs> Are we okay? Yeah, yeah, it's just some paperwork. Putting Marcia on the trust, it's bullshit. Yeah. yeah. Doesn't, uh, doesn't affect me stepping out. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, it's so just, worried. Do I need to lawyer all this? It's housekeeping. Bro, read something before you sign it. Oh, hell no. Yeah, this is like a test, bro. I don't even care. If you don't, don't even look at it and sign it, he's going to know you're not ready. Yeah, Marcy's fine by me. The others might not feel the same, but I'll deal with that. Oh, idiot. What an idiot. I have five Aww. farms, and underneath Tisk -tisk. all my farms runs a giant aquifer. That's like an underground lake. That's and so I have cool. I have pumping rights. That means I get to take the water. That's right? so it's cool. very important because someday water's going to be more precious than gold. I would pay money to shoot that guy in the face. <laughs> People do this, but it's he's right. Water is, water is gonna be more precious than gold. And, and the people hoarding it, I will kill them. Yeah. That's not a joke. <laughs> Hoard water, I'll kill you. You ain't taking my water. Hello, hello there. I'm actually I'm actually here to see you. Hello, hello. Stand back. Oh, I'm Greg. I'm Marianne's Greg. My mom called Marshall and I talked to that guy. And he said I, I could go up. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Greg's a fucking idiot. Happy birthday and many happy returns. Oh, thank you. What did you get him? A $20, uh, like, bottle of something? If he's not going to recognize a 10, 15K gift, mm. then what is that kid going to get him? <laughs> I think you have to bring something. I think it's just the rule. It doesn't matter. I'll bring a sticker and slap my name on someone else's gift. <laughs> nah. Excellent, wonderful. Okay, give me room. Give me room. <laughs> you don't like any of these people. <laughs> Whole family. It's like, fuck them. <laughs> Y'all all fuck. Yeah, this is not relatable with how my family is. You gotta hug everybody and say hi to everybody. Uh, everybody. This is, uh, Craig, by the way. <laughs> Greg. It's, it's Greg. No? no? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Greg. <laughs> Greg. Greg. <laughs> you just didn't even say anything. <laughs> Come on, man. Ray's about to be Craig for the rest of his life. Here, this is just a token of my very real and enduring admiration. And Kendall! Oh, shut the fuck up. Uh, you came? You got yeah, the course. deal? He got no, priorities, priorities I guess. You know, his dad. What's ah. important, your dad's birthday or a billion dollar deal? His dad's gonna like the deal, you bitch. I'm not losing this deal. Boom. Ten flakes over. Boom. Acquisition. Yeah. That's how it's done. God, is he okay? I would get a heart attack. It's a goo. It's a fucking goo. It's perfect. <laughs> it's sourdough starter. Amazing. Why? I thought that you might what? like to make something. I fuck with a sourdough starter. Okay. That shit takes generations, bro. That was an idea. I thought you might like it. I do. I just don't know what the fuck it is. <laughs> it's sourdough starter to make bread. Oh, okay. Logan's old bread. He's nice. <laughs> he's a nice old man, you know? Old bread. Thank you very much. Be nice. He is being nice. Are you kidding? What? He just got old bread. What? what? Are y'all shitting sourdough starter is a good gift? Yeah, I'm he's... not, but Logan did not like that gift. I mean, being nice said thank you. <laughs> I know how to read people. That wasn't he's a sincere... He's shitting about the bread, for sure. It was not a sincere thank you. Sorry I haven't Skyped with you guys in a couple days. I've Skyped? Busy. Ugh. Okay, boomer. You see Isla up there? You guys want to go see her maybe make a drawing for Grandpa for his, for his birthday? Oh, yeah, so he's got a wife and kids. That he hasn't seen in a couple of days. Or Skyped. Oh, uh, you got your message that He's doing Skyped. a business. Oh, yeah. yeah. In the middle of the divorce, or what are we doing? Just, oh, you know, no. This all goes through. The next two weekends will be kind of crazy. Once it's done, it'll be great if... Yeah, you know, no, it's fine. Bank the weekends, spend them later. Yeah. Ah, yeah. yeah. Already divorced. And if you want, we could grab dinner for the handover. Of, what, like two weekends? No. Are you... Is that not... Are you seeing someone? Oh, oh, oh. Yep. Yeah. That's the yes face. And I'm just hoping this one doesn't leave coke smeared all over the kids' iPads. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Jesus. Oh, God. It was three years ago, but it's well, I'm, I'm fucking with you. It's okay. It's okay. You're good. It don't matter how many years ago that was. Coke on the kids' iPads is going to be a you will hear this on the day that you die, sir. <laughs> If I was a kid, I'd think it's sugar. Right. Put it straight in my butt. Is that what you do with sugar? No. Weirdo. This guy knows. This no, not me. No. I'd just lick it. If I was a kid, I would lick it. Please. About the what I was talking about. Shut up, Greg! <laughs> Greg! Greg! <laughs> There, there was an issue, and I just talked to my mom. He's just to trying to get his job back. <laughs> Throw him out of a window. I'll do anything for my brother. That's nice. Um, I'm going to work 100%. All he needs 100%. to do is just ask. All he needs to do is ask. 
I mean, you, you two don't talk so much, right? Anything. Just get him to ask me. Damn. <laughs> I love that. On the family trust, which will decide the situation in the oh, event of my... Water guy's a brother, too? ...unlikely demise. I'm going to add Marcy here. to myself and you four. Oh, okay. And my seat also to go to her <gasps> on my death. Well, that gives her a double voting weight. Oh. Candle's already signed, but if I... Oh! Two votes, I don't... Boy, got you! Mm. You ain't ready, Kendall. <laughs> but look, I love the bread. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Chris. I wouldn't. I wouldn't like the bread either. I wouldn't have got it for you. I want someone to get me some. No starter. I make bread, baby. Despite the chatter and uh, all things considered, I'm gonna give it a couple of years. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God. I'll stay in situ. Oh my God, this is awesome. Chairman, CEO, head of the. Look at his face. I know. What? What? It's like he just, it just hit him. Oh my God. It just said, son, are we not listening? Ooh, Ooh, drama! You didn't tell me. We can announce you in pole position, pending events, a move up or whatever. Pending events? Okay, come on, let's see. First you saw on a paper. Dropped a bomb and just left. I don't know what you're fucking laughing about. I'm not Is he the baby? Laughing. He's got baby what? energy. Yeah, he looks like the youngest. Fuck, what the fuck? He's, he's, he's gonna blow the firm's credibility. Ken, this is typical, it's dad. I'm out. Whatever you three decide goes. Goodbye. I don't want to engage. I'm water. I float. Fucking Cameron! <laughs> Cameron, we, we stand Cameron. I, I like, Do we I stand like his Cameron? Vibe. We like Cameron. I like his vibe, though. Cameron's hoarding water in Except the Except the hoarding water part. It, oh, fucking. It's Connor. Oh, you're, you're fucking shrugging me? It's Connor? Oh, oh Cameron, Connor. Cameron from... Oh, Cameron from... Uh, Ferris Bueller. Yeah. I was like, uh, but Craig's Craig to me. I don't care. Are you telling? Did he tweet it out already? He's in here, okay? Well, this is a lockdown. Advice. This is a lockdown. You're gonna give a double vote to a, a power-hungry maniac who will do fuck knows what with it because she's got her dead stick and some supermax oh, pussy God. grip and she's juicing him. Jesus! God. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> she's juicing it before he. Probably it's supermax dead. pussy pussy grip. But her having two votes, say she gets one of siblings on her side, and it's like three and three. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, it's a big swing vote. It is a big swing vote. And the siblings gonna be vying for her uh, vote. You fuck me. It's mainly me. You also didn't have anyone look at that paper before you signed it. Mm -hmm. like your sister was like, "I'm gonna have my lawyers look at this." Yeah, it's called rehab, and I'm in recovery. I'm just concerned you might be soft. I, I, I did a fucking year in Shanghai. I hear you let the guy from the website trash talk you and you just let him come. Not a website. And I was I was being professional. I hear it played weak, conflict averse. Damn. I wasn't about to get into a fucking big dick competition. That's right? what this is though, isn't it? And then he shot up to the birthday. I hear you bent for him. Hmm? What? I what? I hear you bent for him and he fucked you. Jesus. <laughs> Sometimes it is a big dick competition. I should have shouted at some guy, but I didn't. So you've ripped up 18 months of corporate strategy? And you never lawyered the trust, James. I, I trusted my father. That's a black mark. <clears throat> it's an accumulation. <laughs> no, it's facts. That's just... You left the room. The deal. To come to my dad's fucking birthday party, because we don't know how many more it's there'll three. be. three. Three strikes. Sorry. I mean, you don't know how many more there's going to yeah, be. Yeah, it is. He, that should have been a nice thing that he came here. But I guess business first with this family. He should know that. He's in the family. It's just far removed from any Indian family. Five years? You think you're going to live ten. for ten, ten years? Yeah, seriously. It's my fucking company. How many ten seasons? Your fucking Four. Company. Four. You're, what? You're, you're running it Four into the no ground. Where's the vision? You're off the beat. Where's the growth? All our graphs go down. Is that why you're paying a billion dollars for a gay little website? No. <laughs> it's a portfolio of online brands and digital video content, and it's part of an upstream investment strategy to save us. If you'll just let me. Arthur. I was gonna say, not the Arthur fist. <laughs> Do you wanna hit me? Is that it? Go on. Go on. Well, still off all of Bro, don't, don't, don't kill the old man. Dad, come on. What are you doing? Are you gonna fucking cry? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Kendall, are you fucking Stop crying? it, I feel bad for Kendall now. <laughs> You know, this has been floated already. There's fucking paps outside. I'm getting asked for quotes. You smear those paps. Fuck them. Fuck them. Fuck them. <laughs> Studio was going to tank when I bought it. Everyone was going to stay home with videotape. But guess what? No, they want to go out. No one was going to watch network except you give it a zing and they do. You make your own reality. Oh. Once you've done it, apparently, everyone's of the opinion it was all so fucking obvious. Lunch. Oh. <gasps> 
Uh, Kendall is like maybe a little too timid well, though. Like he needs more of a spine to like exist in this world, right? I don't know, man. He's kind of like, I don't know. He's hunched over a little bit. He's backing down. He did back down from the dude at the beginning. Boy used to have a coke addiction. He was fucking <laughs> not on top of this dude's head, and then he came to his dad's birthday and trusted his dad to sign up some paper. <laughs> he did regular person stuff, but in this world, yeah, he's an idiot. <laughs> Huh? What's the plan here? I oh, just breaking things. So the help can clean it. <laughs> Come on. Why the bathroom though? Grow up. It's the most childish shit I've seen. What's the point of being a billionaire if you're not happy, buddy? Because <laughs> you want to be an even more billionaire. See, Rome. Rome has the the, the idea. Ew, my dude. He wanted to be a billionaire, billionaire. Oh, and you gonna clean it up? That's some bitch shit, ain't it? <laughs> Dad's gonna be like, I can't believe you cleaned up that mess you made. <laughs> Don't you have the balls to get the help to clean it up, huh? <laughs> You're not ready. What are we paying for? <laughs> I'm surprised rich people don't have like a mess room where they just go to break shit. Mm. It's everywhere. When you're rich, you don't have to have a designated mess room. You just buy new shit. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're redoing the bathroom. Bro, to break all that and clean that, lunch should be over. I think I like Greg. I think Greg's my favorite. <laughs> I hope he stays the whole show. Logan Roy. <laughs> Born in Dundee, Scotland. 80 years ago today, <laughs> raised in Quebec by an uncle with a print shop and a few advertising billboards, Logan himself has made a decent way for himself these past 60 years. He's tough, he's wily, but he's always true to his word. I arrived uh, to give him legal advice 30 years ago, and I never got out the door. And since that day, I'm proud to call him a friend. Let's raise a toast. This motherfucker might be the only dude he actually likes. <laughs> and uh, his wife, the pussy grip. I think it's time to play the game. Time to play the game. Do we have to play? It's all about the game. <laughs> What's and the game? And I can play it. <laughs> <laughs> What's the game? Bingo. This is outdoors. Yahtzee. They're going to go quail hunting. Is there room in there? Okay. <laughs> and with his little backpack, he don't know. Damn, bro. <laughs> She's shitty. <laughs> Sorry if it's a crush. Oh, um, yeah, I was just talking to my grandpa. Uh-huh. And he said happy birthday. It occurred to me talking to him that him having his seat on the holding company still, uh, from historically, it, now that must be suboptimal in some ways. Is he? Is he? Is it's Craig Greg smart? Um, if I could, if he, yeah. if he was willing to give his is seat to no. someone a bit more perspicacious. Oh my God! Running a, a theme park, <laughs> say. Shooting a shot. The park. Just a little guy learning. You know, is there an angle there, perhaps? <laughs> <laughs> Good old non-answer. Can't even have a car ride without someone trying to finagle a deal or something, you know? I do, like... I mean, but for he too. about that shit, ain't it? Didn't he just cuss out his son for coming to his birthday? Yeah. He might have preached, like, at least Greg's giving it a try. Is that a helicopter game? Where are we going? It's like GTA like, 4. Like, rich, rich. Like, stupid rich. Oh, you rich, rich. Like, mad rich. <clears throat> what? You guys don't have a helicopter yet? It's fuck you money. Oh, yeah, we have that normie helicopter on the roof, by the way. Yep, yep, well, whenever we do collabs with Blind Wave, yeah, just, just fly out to them. It'd be quicker to get to. I'd love to get you back in. It's just, um, it's tough. Last time, it was very tough with Frank over me in LA. I had a lot of ideas at the studio. I was met with a lot of resistance. Is this, uh, still the film thing? Oh, what, Robot Olympics? No. Dad, <laughs> it's awesome. not about one fantastic idea. Yeah? Tell me more about the Robot Olympics. <laughs> that does sound kind of cool. I <laughs> wonder why he likes you okay? Roman more. More, mm. more charismatic. He's got the riz. I think he's the baby. He's just giving him baby specialties. Plus, what? By the time you're in kid number four, you know what you're doing a little bit more, right? <clears throat> oh just yeah. Play baseball? I forgot about yeah, baseball. We flew out here to play baseball. They ain't got baseball in New York. No nah, man, private baseball field. Now the things are getting shaken up. Did you come inside? Dad, I'm not just playing with the politics. Oh, no. Not to be crude about it, but uh, politics is what comes out the asshole. You'd rather be up front feeding the horse. To come back, I'd want the Tom Trump. Oh, my God, they're all crazy. Can we not work as a family? No. Mm, there's only one person that could be in that over here holding that damn box. What's the rescue pup mm. looking for? Hey, screwed up. He needs help. He might fit in eventually to the parks. You think Tom can handle the competition? Oh, no. Is that Tom? That's Tom. That's so, her husband. I just wanted to give this to you in person just to say, uh, you know, happy birthday. 
It's a watch. Oh. It's Pat just it? a, it's a attack for me. So. So. So you know, guys. So. Yeah, it's a, it's a, I learned about them from the Migos. <laughs> it tells you exactly how rich you are. I don't know what that funny. is. <laughs> Did you rehearse that? <laughs> no. No, well, no. Yes. Okay. <laughs> it's like watching The Office. What is this? Oh, boy. Did he say there thank you? There was your you? moment. There nope. was your moment. He didn't say thank you. He said a funny little joke. He said, that's cute. All of us on the trust, full block. We say stability, stick to the plan. I take over, and we just, you know, you two under me, co-presidents. <clears throat> under you. You know, three. Power of three. Charmed. Interesting. Can we think about it? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I thought about it. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Just split it three ways, I guess. Get your brother drunk. Put a hooker in his bed. Take photos, blackmail him. Imagine marrying into this family. Like, you'd probably have to be rich yourself, right? Probably. Well, I have got my eye on you. No, you need any help. Seriously, any help, any advice. Don't fucking bother. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only razzing you, cuz. Oh my god, there's so much competition okay, in this razzing. family. Okay. Sounds like he wants to feel on top of somebody, at least. But the thing about me is that I'm a terrible, terrible prick. Okay. Tom. What the fuck am I supposed to do about this? I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> fuck me, man. Your face. <laughs> Pals. Stop it. I'm, I'm done talking to you. Would you kiss me? What the fuck? <laughs> what? If I asked you to. What? what I if I told you to? Huh? What's happening? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> Stop! Look at you! What's happening? <laughs> this is great. Tom is weird. What does what does Tom do again? They just kind of explained it. He does the parks. He, he's the head of the parks. Yeah, no. Okay. Craig, Greg will have competition with him. I know Kendall Roy, and look, he's saying Logan's lost it. <gasps> That's what I'm hearing from people close to the family. Those disloyal fucks. Just, just say source close to the family. Looks like you finally made a play. I feel like if he would have hit his dad, he would respect him more. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, he would have. Hi. You're gonna be, just, you're gonna be fine. Relax. Don't worry about it. Can you hit a ball? Yeah. Great, because I will give you one million dollars if you hit a home run. For, for real? Yes. No, oh, please hit it, kid. Please hit the shit out of the park. Um, don't be an asshole. I'm not being an asshole. I want him incentivized. This is fun. It's a game. Jeez, stop being so serious. So uncomfortable. I don't know. This is weird, yeah. That's how you motherfuckers run with money? It's how it is. I hear a million dollars ain't shit to you? I'm telling you, brother. Fuck you, money rich, bro. Hit him with the bat. <laughs> Won't get a million dollars. Parents, feel good. I feel bad for the parents. This is very uncomfy. Whoa. Come on, let the kid win. Obviously, it's not happening. Come on, oh, no! This is fucked up. It's like the rich people messing with the poor. You know what I mean? Like dangling that in front of them. That was so close. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't give it to you. That would have counted. Next time, bring a fork and a knife and eat these motherfuckers. Quite tremendous. So take this back to your life. It's a quarter million. Enjoy. The <laughs> fuck, bro? Fuck you. Damn. Magnificent effort. Thank you. Magnificent. Yeah, cool. What is that gonna do? Thanks. You raised a bunch of assholes, idiot. At least he salvaged it. Logan is Did he salvage a, it? a little nice. He's a little he's a little bit nice. Motherfucker, I had a million dollars a second ago and I got a handshake now. Bitch, pay for my college. Y'all can easily afford it. Yeah, pay for my college. Fuck run them goddamn dollars. Nothing Are you serious? For free. He had to get a home run. And you know what he did? He got three bases. I feel like that's close enough to the home run. If the home run was worth a million, technically my guy still two, made a couple of motherfucking dollars. I, think, I don't give a fuck. I think he got two bases. Or one base, really. I don't like Roman now. <laughs> I don't know, I liked him. Take the stock, you'll own a nice piece of us. Connor. Well, that is an appealing package. Start talking shit. So because I'm the whole company. Yeah, I think you're gonna stick around because I'm gonna stuff your mouth with so much money you're gonna shit gold figurines. I'm gonna lock you in a golden cage, fuck you with a silver dildo, and pay you so much you sing whatever song I want. Easy, you still need me to recommend this. No, I don't. This is a deal so fucking good, you have to take it, or we'll see you in court. What? You can't su Dude. sue me for not taking a deal, can you? Maybe it's his fiduciary responsibility or some shit. How you doing, sir? I'm Colin. I work for Mr. Logan Roy and there the Roy family. We'd like to keep this quiet today if, uh, if you agree to that. Uh, we'd like to have you sign a, a non-disclosure agreement. Well, an NDA? Just that they were even here? You better get paid for this NDA. My signature worth a lot. Now <laughs> isn't uh, time for a new role for you. Light duties. Light duties. Even his best friend. That's it. After 30. Really? It's a Frank? Jesus Christ, I'm here. Don't worry. 
You get your nut. Connor! Jeff! Roman! The other helicopter! Fucking getting cornered them to sign that now. Damn, bro. You just got demoted. For fuck all. After being the most loyal person and then ISIS. Oh, it's gonna get you, bro. Frank's out of the picture. Yeah? Tom's stepping up. Fucking hey, dude. That's it. Frank's in the water. Is this all for Marcy's signature or whatever? Marcy's blood, whatever. It's for Roman for Romans, really. Yeah, right. Welcome. Con. I'm with these two what they say goes. The water. <laughs> Our position Low is like this water. doesn't quite work for us at present. You what? It's not sufficiently attractive as a proposition. <laughs> he just acts okay. frank like that just to get this and they're not even... So Kelly, uh... Who's Kelly? Kelly wants to have some figures. You should see that, uh... Every Dad? Day. Yeah, he, oh, well. Dad, it's just a first gonna, position. Dad. Grasp. Dad. Oh. Hospital. Uh, hospital. Take us to a hospital. Okay, yeah, now. He's really, he's really hot. He's really hot. He's really hot. Oh, he's hot. Okay, though. Open a window. Yeah. Uh, can't do that on a. No. <laughs> Sounds like your dad just passed out on a helicopter. Eat dick, Choom. Hey, you heard the news? What? Deal. It's all very exciting. I can't wait to we see. We got a deal? Anymore. Yeah. Serious? I hope there's no hard feelings over all the shit talking. The news I was talking about is it. Your dad just had a brain hemorrhage. <laughs> yeah. I'm so sorry. Are you? But you just invited me into the chicken coop. And without daddy around to protect you, I'm gonna eat you all, one by fucking one. What happened to that silver dildo bit? <laughs> <laughs> Where the paper signed? The zoom in, so the, the camera is its own character here. Were, were the papers signed officially? Hello? Dad is in the hospital. They think he's had a brain hemorrhage. Frank's still Hey, you know what would be shitty, bro? If I was Frank, like, I heard he had, like, <laughs> damn. <laughs> that was rough, I got fired, though. <laughs> Sorry. Uh. You guys are actually emotional now. All right, so there's 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 heart in there somewhere, right? There's some there's still some love. Are you looking for? I don't know. I'm gonna be a little more convincing personally. I cannot fucking wait for some of these Interesting. episodes for you guys to see them. This is just crazy. I'm so this is so dysfunctional, man. The way it ended with all the chatter, like what is the overlapping news reports? Yes, it did. It, it did end that way. Yes. I mean, I'm trying to figure out what what's the meaning of that is. Well, they is run a news, a news company. company. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, and about how all the news chatter and like all of this is just noise. It's just you noise. still got the regular people in here living their regular fucking lives while That's while right. they're trying just, to find the symbolism. And I know, like freaking the first. I mean, you should, right? I mean, it's like that. that what, what do you take doing, away from it? That too. I'm just, I'm just letting it sit for a little bit. Yeah, I'm not gonna know right away. <laughs> I don't know. You were. I thought maybe you had one no, of them surge nuggets. No, the nugget is yeah, all the noise and comparatively, the people responsible for that noise are over here just being scumbags to each other and to the people that they're running into. Like that little boy and his family. Like, I don't know. It's just, I'm not supposed to like any of these people, right? <laughs> uh, well, I definitely know. Um, I don't know. That's a good perspective. Yeah. It's like Game of Thrones, but with unlikable, realistic people. It's like, this is how loud our world is. That's what, that's what fucking life feels like to me. But yeah. like, for them, it's just quiet little conversations. Little one-on-one -on -one conversations just to move around and get your, get your fucking bag, I guess. I don't know. I feel like they all have so much money, though, that the only thing they're really vying for now is, like, power and big quotes here. Legacy and shit? And yeah, I don't know. I mean, always. I guess if you got everything, what else you're going to go for? I feel like every single one of these motherfuckers was on Epstein's Island at least once. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe not safing, but the rest of them, I don't know. Y'all know. You got all that money, what you doing? Mm -hmm. You fucking doing with all that. You don't want to be a billionaire? No. Hard pass. Morally oh, corrupt, soulless, fuckboy individuals who have enough money to fix the problems in the world and continue to not do it. Every single one of them can line up and eat a dick, eat a bag of baby dicks. <laughs> a lot of, I mean, maybe not all celebrities, but a lot of them try to. I said billionaires. I don't know. I feel like with the amount of billionaires that exist, at least one of them would have fixed the world's problems by now. So there's got to be some sort of catch or something we don't know. Yeah, you won't once, be a billionaire that anymore. Club, that's the catch. Yeah, you won't. Yeah, you won't have the money. <laughs> That's the catch. You lose your money. You'll be a but, hundred millionaire. But, but if you're a billion, you, if you presumably have so much that you could fix the world's problems and still be like a millionaire. So, so the question Gates. is, why don't you? And the only answer I can come up with 
It's because you're an awful person. But every single one of them, though, yes. like I think no having that much money breaks your brain. I, I think we just don't guys. hear in the news yeah. about the people that are doing good. Now, how come they don't? The people themselves can say it. They got money to effectively be like, "Hey, I'm doing this thing. Look at me do it." I don't want to Google that's gonna, this, that's but like, look I do all think ne- that negative. like Bill Gates is donating all his money. None is going to his children. All his money is going to like. I think I don't. Know. If, I have if, to if, look if this a billionaire up. spent money on news to promote that they were donating money, you would call that person out for being two faced. Like, why do you got to promote that you're doing? Like, I mean, if they were like, "I'm solving homelessness," then yes, I would love to hear that. In fact, I can think of a specific billionaire who said, "If someone comes up with a plan for me to solve homelessness, I'll do it." And then he bought Twitter instead. Was that you? Like, <laughs> was it world hunger or homelessness? Yeah, I think yeah. it was homelessness. Yeah. Uh, so was world we've got too. the money to do it. Acon. Acon. Not a billionaire. It's we but don't know helps. because we've never been in that power. But once you get there, you never want to lose it. That's Be, just it's an addiction. I'm telling you, right? it's a thing. That's what, I think it's a brain thing. Yeah, I think literally 100%. after you've accumulated so much power and money that you're like, why the fuck would I give this shit up? Because this is nothing. Like okay. he would be able to rip, rip this shit in half. It's just paper, yeah. No, but it's like, real money. you're right. It becomes an addiction, and then presumably you want to pass that on to your next generation, right. and like that's how. You know, like the main thing villains strive for in every like supernatural story is like immortality. Mm-hmm. True immortality in this world is generational fucking wealth and becoming the people that actually like control the shit here, yeah. or just sustaining the future for generations and generations. I mean, that's why he's being so careful about who he passes the, uh, Logan, who he passes the shit off to. But I'm not saying it's okay for them to do that. I'm just saying like I feel it. Once, I- you, once you pass a certain threshold. Even you might be tempted, or even I might be tempted to be fucking addicted. Right. To no, that. that's yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah. I think that once you, I, I don't. I think it's everybody. I think it's like it's like it's not, any yeah. motherfucker who's like, I can do all the coke in the world and be fine. It's like okay, you're gonna hit a certain threshold. It's gonna break your brain. Yeah, exactly, I think yeah. accumulating that amount of money breaks your fucking brain. Also, like it, they're on some kings and queens shit. Like we, we, we started this whole entire country to be based off of not doing that, and we're kind of back around to doing it. These are the oligarchs. These are the motherfuckers. When he was like, damn, you in politics? He's like, politics is what comes out of the fucking asshole. Yeah. He's like, you want to be in the front feeding the horse? We got conglomerates, motherfucker. They move because we say move. Yeah. What you about to yeah. have her on? Exactly. You think we're not going to have the lobbyists knocking on exactly. the door, yeah. fixing shit? You know how this works. Yeah. So, like. That's cool, he, though. In that sense, like, they, they, this news corporation owns everything at yeah. this point, right? They own and a your own others. opinion. Like, they're making you think of a certain way. And like, Unless you're, like, you know... I don't know if they get into this, research. but, like, are they going to get... In- Sorry for interrupting you. Oh, so you The, like, lobbyists and stuff and, like, donating to, like, campaigns and things like that, I'm assuming. Like, I don't know if that's, like, on individuals or if it's from conglomerates oh, also. From conglomerates. Yeah. But um, it's interesting because I always wanted to show that kind of, like, peeled back the layer to show this. And it, it's cool that it's it's a family drama <laughs> in a way, even though no one's really like super <coughs> likable yet, at least. It's just the pilot. Connor. I'm assuming they throw a lot of stuff in the mm. pilot to like see what catches and then they yeah. focus on certain things. I'll be interested in seeing where it goes. I mean, y'all know my opinion. I'm excited to watch wait. the show. Though. I know. This I is like have you guys the villain's it. show yeah, for me. It, it literally is. Yeah, I, I love say, it. Man. I was going to say, I don't Aww. know if you would like any of them. And this Pat all... loves a billionaire. I wish he was I know. Here. This uh, is what would have been Pat's the pilot right here. He, Pat was going to jump in, but his allergies were being really bad today. I know like all and of them are weird. not supposed to be likable, but some of them can be likable. I mean, besides Cameron hoarding. No, I mean, I Connor. like, there are people in the show I like, yeah. but not for reasons that you should like. Oh, exactly. Yeah, like yeah. Connor, There's... he's just sweet, you know, this like little bread starter. I love that. And he's like, his dad was just so funny about it. And Rome, okay, Rome Romulus. knows what's up. Rome's having Romulus? fun. What? Romulus. He call, is his full name Romulus? Yeah. They yeah. call him yeah. Rome for short? Yeah. Jesus Christ. But you gotta appreciate <laughs> him though. He's Roman. having fun. Roman. And Roman his Rome. Thing. He yeah. has multiple names. But Romulus is his full name. It's Romulus, Kendall, Shaban, and C- Shaban, not Siobhan? I can't. Shaban. I don't know then, what that name is. And then goes. they call him her Shiv and stuff. Shiv. Shiv. And you want him in the ribs. Uh, will you look up the founders of Rome? Please. Uh, uh, I... They're like there are some nice qualities to every one of them, but mostly they're all shit. And the nice qualities are just like, oh, there's some humanity in yeah. here. Yeah. Oh, look, like, they're regular like, people. There's a speck of uh, humanity there. I guess you are nice. That's the nice. Oh, thing. okay. Like because uh, Karen Culkin's character, Rome. Rome. This is a dickish thing to do to that kid. Oh, man. Yeah. Like, Matt, know, that he's a, a dick. Oh. Bro. <laughs> For doing that, he's that a dick. Would, 
ruined my life. Uh, I will say, I mean, it really would, bro. <laughs> like, damn, I'm just supposed to. I could have been a millionaire, but I thought I would never. Li- I didn't. Yeah, know, bro. yeah, fabulous. All right, so nice. I mean, once again, like my guy, he's telling you, bro. I'm trying to build empires out here. I'm trying What's to do that shit. Sculpture. Uh, it's a wolf breastfeeding them. They were raised by wolves. Okay. It's the the, the mythology of Rome. Um, I love like, the shit like talking. Like Remus, Remus Lupin was named after Remus, a little were- yeah. like he's a werewolf. Makes sense. Yeah. Nice. Fun fact. Because he got the milk straight out the wolf titty. That's the best milk <coughs> he said. Yep, yep. Uh, Professor Lupin out here drinking wolf tit milk. Uh, do love the shit talking to show. I think it was really cool. Silver dildo. Fuck you. Bird that. Uh, bloated dinosaur. All of it. I, I really enjoyed the shit talking this. And I think that the writers probably had a lot of fun writing that. Yeah. The that zoom part's ins, fun. though. So, like, I just want to talk about the zoom ins, too. They obviously. I think because like they don't actually have like a camera following them. Nobody, they're not gonna actually allow this to be filmed. So is this just like new camera? I don't know. What? No, the camera is just just how aesthetics. Yeah. Aesthetics. How they're doing it? Then, I mean, yeah, it's interesting. I've never seen like I guess a drama show doing it that much zoom ins, but it's cool. Yeah, some uh, in, in American TV, I yeah. guess, at least. Older older shows used to do that before mockumentary style yeah. was a thing, like more handheld zooms like that, kind of like. It punctuate things it's supposed to kind of give off the vibe yeah, that that's, this is I was a gonna real say, it was, it's, thing it's but. punctuating what they're feeling yeah. like it's yeah. showing you because i haven't seen that in like <laughs> what a long their time. vibe is in that moment yeah yeah um the mom the, the, the stepmom marcy is her name do you like yeah. her i like I her I actress know. she okay. hasn't said anything no. I, I, you <laughs> never she hasn't mentioned said her. anything too so like here's the thing is she just like the <laughs> quiet silent like deadly like just waiting to take power is she actually a good person because like she looked concerned her, like, at the end yeah she like saw when he walked in for his birthday she like, like rubbed his head like oh he's here yay like she like she, yeah. does she like i mean i don't think she does not love him but uh-uh. she looks she looked a little concerned at the end i mean they all looked actually concerned but I think he himself, Logan, wouldn't have chosen someone that he at least wanted to trust with, like, the double voting power. Yeah. Like, he's not just giving it to someone willy-nilly. He actually does care about the company. So maybe he just actually trusts this woman. Bruh. So like, Because, like, if you're going to be with him, you're going to get some of that power regardless. I mean, that's his so, like, partner. Yeah. Some ambition is to be expected. And maybe it's exactly the amount that Logan wants out of, like, that. Bruh, I can't believe he of. cut Frank off. Kid said no. Brain hemorrhage in the plane. That's wild, bro. <laughs> so, hey, Frank, I know we've been doing this shit for 30 years, but um, you're getting demoted, so my idiot Fucked son can up, step bro. up. Because Frank's like, damn, bro, here at the baseball park? He's like, yeah. That's because speech. because the robot Olympics never happened. <laughs> That's just like such spoiled kids. Bro, his family over everything, but I feel like his family's just an extension of him. Like, I don't even know if he sees them as autonomous individual people, and he's much more like, what well, y'all do reflect directly onto me, so like, play the game right, you know? Yeah. Um, I will say, out of all of the things, it was very charming. They had a little baseball game. That's cute. I, I, I get that. To go all the way out there, though? I mean, yeah, but, like, I don't know. It's like, <laughs> look, they're doing regular, fun, normal activity. Mm-hmm. Normal baseball activity. I'm excited to see the power moves. Ugh. Yep. All right. Anyway. Well, that was the pilot. Guys, if you were watching this on YouTube now, we filmed this a long time ago. Mostly, most, probably all the series is on Patreon. Check it out, at least the first season. If you're on Patreon, then you're seeing this for the first time. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.